In this video, let's compare the export time on the new iMac M3. So how this is gonna work is that we'll be exporting two videos. The first one will be a five minute video and it will be rendered at 2K at 60 FPS. It is originally a 1080p video, which is upscaled to 2K. And the next one is a 20 minutes 4K video. That's gonna be interesting. We'll be testing out the three popular video editors, Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro and DaVinci Resolve. Who do you think is gonna win? Of course DaVinci Resolve, bro. And what do you think? Premiere Pro. <laughs> All right, so I basically upgraded the RAM or unified memory as Apple likes to call it. I have absolutely no idea why the 8GB variant exists, to be honest. The one I'm using is the 24GB variant. We'll review soon. My name is Prithviraj and let's get right into it. For the first test, we'll be exporting this gaming clip of mine, upscaled to 2K at 60fps. I exported both MP4 and MOV to test it out. The results were more or less similar for both. One thing I need to mention at the start is that we'll be exporting with the built-in export mode in Premiere Pro. We won't be using Adobe Media Encoder for that purpose. The results were actually very surprising. Both Premiere Pro and DaVinci Resolve exactly took 3.04 minutes to export. Coincidence? The surprising part was that Final Cut Pro took 3.08 minutes to export. That's 4 seconds more. Whereas Final Cut was supposed to be the most optimized among them all. I have set similar bit rates on all of them. All the editors did a great job I must say. It was a really close battle. But now things change. We will be exporting a 20 minutes long 4K video. I have simply made random edits on the timeline. I have opened the same XML file on all of them. One thing I must point out we did face a lot of issues trying to import the xml file on final cut we had to use third party converters and never mind also we have added the same lut on all of them so what do you think the order will be like i think uh, davinci then uh, final cut and then i think premium pro i think uh, my money is on final cut then davinci and lastly <laughs> how much <laughs> Well, the moment of truth. Let's start with Premiere Pro since it was the surprise in the previous test. Let's begin in 3, 2, and 1. Well, I'm still waiting. Bro. Finally. It's giving us an estimate of 16 minutes. Let's fast forward till the end and let's see how it worked out. Surprise, surprise. Premiere took a total of 22 minutes and 49 seconds to export. That's really disappointing. It shouldn't be taking that long. Let's test it with DaVinci Resolve. One good thing about DaVinci is that they show us the time it took to export by themselves. We will still be keeping a stopwatch though. Let's again begin in 3, 2, and 1. We are getting an estimate of about 17 to 20 minutes. I'm sure it's not gonna take that long, but I'm happy that we didn't have a wait time like Premiere just for the export to begin. DaVinci Resolve exported this video in only 12 minutes and 17 seconds. It's 10 minutes faster than Premiere. That's an improvement. Finally, let's try out with Final Cut Pro. Let's begin in 3, 2, and 1. Well, I'm not really a fan of the export window in Final Cut. Fast forward until the end, and it only took 10 minutes and 20 seconds. And we clearly have a winner, and my prediction was kind of right. Well, Premiere Pro was totally deserved pointing I must say. I have been using Premiere Pro as my primary video editor for several years now but yeah I finally switched to DaVinci Resolve and to be honest I have absolutely zero regrets about that. If you want to know why I switched to DaVinci Resolve then click here. Thanks for watching please consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you there.